And Scott Crazy for Sons of the American Legion Radio, where we are covering Army summer football practice. And we have a chance to talk to one of the captains of the Black Knights this year, and that is Sandon McCoy, who's a senior from Kannapolis, North Carolina. Sandon, how are you today? How was practice? I'm great. Practice was good. Okay. I know it's hot out there and you got to practice indoors. Um, tell us a little bit about what was the experience like for you this spring? Uh, uh, everyone went home, uh, studied online, took instruction online, came back over the summer to West Point. How's it, what have the last uh, uh, three, four months been like for you? You said last, the last four months have been like for me? Yeah. Uh, so, I mean, since COVID started, we didn't come back for spring break. Uh, still had a really great spring break. Uh, took advantage of the time away from West Point just to relax. Um, uh, remote classes was, you know, a blessing. Did really well. <laughs> well I think the whole team did really well in remote uh, learning. Uh, just these past four months, um, uh, you know, just the mindset of just working. Uh, you know, the high, high energy on the team um, coming from, you know, our last loss against Navy. And that's what's just been driving us this whole summer. Yeah. Um, tell us a little bit about your career. I mean, last year you uh, really moved into being a key contributor uh, for Army. You had uh, five, almost uh, 600 yards rushing, uh, carried 135 times. Uh, uh, how did you feel your career was progressing and your ability to contribute uh, last year? Um, I think it, I mean, it was it was slow, steady. Um, you know, coming into the year, I didn't think I would. Uh, have that great of a, a season or that good of a season. Uh, I know last year was just in the beginning. I still have a lot to a lot to work on, a lot of fundamentals still to improve on. But uh, just the attitude, I'm just ready to work and get better every day. How is it for you to be named a captain of the West Point football team? Uh, as they say, West, West Point's uh, the premier leadership development institution in the world, and, and you're the leader of uh, – the Army football team, uh, one of the three tri captains. How does it feel to be named a captain at West Point? Uh, just honored, honestly. Um, but nothing, nothing will change. I'm still the same person, you know, uh, just serving the team the best way I can. Yeah, very good. Now, tell us a little bit about the academic side. Good to hear that you 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 did well online in the spring. Uh, uh, what are you studying academically? Uh, so my major is law and legal studies. Very good, very good. Is that uh, is that to help point you in a direction for a future Army branch? Uh, no, I doubt it. <laughs> I wanted to go combat arms, so <laughs> I won't be. Uh, go infantry or uh, armor or field artillery. Uh, preferably armor. Yeah, you want you want to you, you like those uh, the um, Abrams tanks and all. By the time oh, yeah. you get, maybe they'll have some new ones. Hey, that's great. Uh, Charles Swan, who is one of our friends, is always talking about the importance of the armor division uh, and uh, uh, to the Army. And uh, tell us a little, uh, just a little bit, how is it to lead the team? There's a lot of uncertainty going on right now. Uh, how is it just to keep the players moving in the, in the, in the right direction during this uh, very un unprecedented time? Oh, it's not hard at all, honestly. Uh... I think we all have the same goal, and that's to practice, plan, prepare uh, to, if we do have a season, just to go out there and, and, and do our very best so we can have a, a winning season. So that, that's that's not hard. That's not a problem at all. And you talked a little bit about the disappointing uh, day against Navy last year and how that sticks in your mind. How is that a motivating factor uh, this year? Uh, uh, well, we hope you get a chance to, to play them uh, later this year. Uh, I think after that game, we came back after that weekend. It's been the driving motivation energy on this team to this day, even in quarantine. I can only imagine. Um, mm -hmm. you know, after after uh, the uh, three wins in a row uh, over Navy. And uh, do you have a final thought? Maybe you want to say hello to your uh, friends and family back in North Carolina? Uh, yeah, so... Um, miss everyone. I haven't been home in a while. Probably won't be home in a really long time. But no, just want to thank everybody. I hope everyone's staying safe and healthy. Absolutely. We know I don't get the uh, West Point uh, cadets don't get home very much, and players even less. But Santa, really, best wishes to you 
being named captain of the Army football team. And uh, and uh, really best wishes on your year from everybody at the American Legion. Good to, good to chat with you today. You too. Thank you. We'll see you when we get up there. Thank you, Sandon. And it's getting great to for the American Legion, Sons of American Legion radio covering Army football practice today.